Welcome back to Tightwad Workshop. It's autumn here in Canberra, and today I'll be raking up the leaves. This is the kind of quiet, dignified work that perfectly suits a man of my age and gravitas. Now I need to make a compost bin to hold these leaves. These thick planks will work fine for the corners of the bin. I'll use these old fence palings for the panelling. The first step is to find the shortest board. Then I'll use a square to mark its ends, the length isn't important. Next we'll saw off those ragged ends. Now we can use this board as a template to mark all the others. I won't bother cutting this end, it'll be fine for a compost bin. Now we'll saw off the ragged ends of all the other boards in the same way. These boards are a little less than 100mm wide. Our frame rails are all about 1800mm long, so I'll make these bins 900mm high. We need two of these frame rails for each of the four panels. These trestles work well as an assembly surface for the panels. I'm going to skip ahead to the last panel, because by now I was getting good at making them. Start by putting the two rail planks on the trestles. Next, we'll place two of the boards on the ends of the rails. Pre-drill each end of the board. Then attach it to each rail with one nail. I'm reusing the galvanised nails I replaced with screws in my deck. Attach the other board in the same way. Now lay out the other seven boards on top of the rails. Once you're happy with the layout, drill these boards and attach them to the rails with one nail at each end. Now use your tape to measure both diagonals. Adjust the frame and measure again until the diagonals are both the same length. Now we can drill the boards and add a second nail to each one. Once each board is held to the rails with four nails, the panel will stay square. Now we can take the finished panels out to the garden. Each pair of panels is held together with two wire ties. These cut ends of the wire are quite sharp, so make sure to fold them back against the frames. I'm putting the second set of wire ties on from the outside, so that I can still untie them when the bin's full. Now we just need to load the bin with leaves. In about six months the leaves will return to compost, which I'll then dig into the garden. That bird bath also needs a clean, so I'll take care of that now. The 
That's all for now. Thanks for watching. Tightwad Workshop is filmed in front of a live studio audience. I said Tightwad Workshop is filmed in front of a live studio audience.